sponsored by EA. With October 31st not too far off, I want to remind you that I have an EA creator code. If you're planning to pre-order Dragon Age The Veilguard or pick up any previous Dragon Age games through the EA app, remember to apply my code UrbanBohemian at checkout. I get a small commission from the purchase, which helps support the channel. Um, so let's hop on into Cat Cafe Manager and see uh, see what this is all about. Ooh, ambiance. You've traveled all the way from the city to Catterwall Way. It's a small countryside town hidden far away from the bustle of the city. You hardly even remember the town. Don't, don't take it too hard. You were a baby. Let's see here. Mom always seemed to miss this place. Granny stayed when you left. It's only now that you know why. Turns out she was running a business. Hey, Lily, thank you very much for the follow. Ah, you've arrived. Wasn't, wasn't there supposed to be a building here? There's a big man clumsily rummaging around the field. He's all chafed knuckles and smiling eyes. Huh? Uh. I'm not doing the accents today. Not today. Are you supposed to be here? My grand's letter? I know. Who are you? Uh, you? You're either a real charismatic thief or a friend. It's gotten me in trouble before, but I'll go with option two. Okay, that sounds like stories that I want to hear, but all right. Figure your name's little grand type then. I should have known. <laughs> I'm Bonner. I was a good friend of your grand's. <laughs> Couldn't compete with their cats, though. Ha <laughs> ha. What's your name? Let me get a good look at you. What is our name? Okay, so we can change our... Oh, let's see here. Hmm. Okay, let's, let's first, let's get that. And then... Let's find a good blend here. That one? Okay. Nah. Nah. Nah? Okay. Um, alright, let's see here. So, we got pigtails. Ooh, a cap? That could work. Oh, wait, there's a cat hat? Oh, the cat beanie. Okay, in that case... Uh, can we have a mm, purple? Purple cat beanie. <gasps> There's a teal. I like that. No. We'll go back with the... Mm. Purple cat beanie. Okay. Player name. Ooh. No, let's we'll go with herb. Oh. There we go. Perfect. Ugh. <sighs> Look at you. You even got your grand's eyes. Nain was always talking about you. Said that even as a little babe, she liked how you were so... Okay, so we can pick a trait about ourselves. We are gourmand. So, plus two to cooking. Chances of using less ingredients when cooking. Gentle. We have plus two to cat care and plus one stress release for cats. And two, three is a social butterfly. We have a knack for making others feel comfortable. I'm going to go with the cat care because the cats seem to be the primary thing. So I'm gentle. So did Nain's letter say why she wanted you to come here? <laughs> to rebuild her cat cafe. <laughs> I knew it. Let me help you set up. First things first, let's pick a good name. Oh, what is a good name for a cat cafe? I mean, Shesha is actually quite fun. Um, that is actually already pretty clever. I 
I don't know. What's a good name for our cat cafe? Mm. <laughs> Bo meowy. Oh goodness, that's that is a mouthful. Also, with the U, we'd come way late in the phone book, so I don't know. Oh goodness, what's a bruise and muse? Oh, bruise and muse. I like that. Oops, hold on. Will it fit? Can I use the ampersand and be? I'll use the ampersand. That way we can like make a cool design in the, in the shop about it. Um, okay, there we go. Bruise and Muse. Bruise and Muse. Such a clever cat-based pun. Unless it's not a pun. Wouldn't know. I've been pun deaf since age four. Bonner, you would be an amazing Twitch streamer then. No groans at all from you. You hear the telltale sounds of meowing cats. Three little furballs poke their heads past the trees. <gasps> Aww! That one at the top kind of looks like an alpaca. I love it. Ooh, it's some of the stray cats which may roam, which roam Caterwall. This is a perfect opportunity to adopt a cat herb. Need cats for a cat cafe after all. You only have room for one cat right now. You can expand the cafe and take these other two off the street later. Okay, so the black cat has a tiny tummy. They don't need a lot of food. The chill cat has minus one stress need and the clean cat cleans up after themselves. Is there such a thing as a pet that cleans up after itself? What? What? It's tempting to go with the tiny tummy because as we know, no cat has ever been fed ever, so this one needs less food? That's wild. Uh, but I think we'll start with the clean cat, because I don't, I don't like doing litter stuff. So, clean cat. You've won this cat's trust. They would like to be adopted. Go ahead and give them the perfect name. I cannot roll my R's. Um, let's see here. Bubbles. Because you're clean. We have adopted a stray cat. Okay. Haha, <laughs> they seem to trust your herb. Got your grand's feline charms, you do. As you can see, the cafe is just a teeny bit destroyed by a storm. What? Excuse me, what? There was a st Alright. However, I've saved some of the furniture. You received a bunch of shabby looking furniture. Y yay. You'll probably need more chairs though. You can buy some at Gruff's Decorations in town. <laughs> Alright, I'll be sure to check in on you later. For now, good luck turning this field into a cozy little cat cafe. Okay, so. We have goals. It's a notebook from our it's a notebook possibly from our gran. Hello, dear. I hope this notebook helps you along your way. Your goal is to delight your customers. Your customers will have needs, which, when fulfilled, increase their satisfaction. If your customers leave satisfied, they'll gain more delight and also give you more resources for you to expand your cat cafe with. Cats make your customers happy by meeting their cat need, but also have their own needs you'll need to fulfill. Staff automatically perform tasks around the cafe. They'll be useful when your cafe gets bigger. In furniture, each piece of furniture has stats which affect your cafe. Some customers have needs tied to furniture, so pay attention. And resources. Okay, so there are many resources to use to expand your cat cafe. There's fabric, spent on chairs and tables. Nectar, spent on food recipes and ingredients. Fish, for cat materials and stray lures, which can lure in new cats. Love that. Gems are spent on nice decorations at the furniture shop. Gold. Ooh. The highest quality furniture costs gold to purchase. And materials. Spend materials in the build mode when to expand the size of your cafe when building floors. Okay. Okay, L to move around. R to zoom in and out. X to perform tasks. R in spec mode. Okay, so a little hand. Like tasks will appear around your cafe. They range from taking an order to petting a cat. Hold the button to perform them. Hold the right bumper down to enter inspect mode. Use inspect mode to check on the stats of whatever you're near. Okay. 
Hey, Zero, welcome on in. Hello, everybody. Okay, can I... I'm not placing a lure yet. I don't have an entrance. Oh. Ah, okay. Uh, decorate? No. How do I build? Okay. Ah, okay. There's inspect. Okay, so we got bubbles. How do I start building? The Tay is quickly getting away from me. Hold on a second. Uh, Granny's notebook. All right, intro. Okay, I'm gonna save the game now because time is clicking. Time is fastly getting away from us. Um, something that always does make me a little nervous in games is when there's like... Okay, well we can run. Um, can I pick up a mushroom? No. Okay, so this whole empty area is for us to build things. Um, there we go. Okay. Use the design mode to build and decorate your cat cafe. Build mode lets you expand your cafe and place four wallpapers. Uh, cost you materials. You can remove things. Decorate lets you place and move furniture. Chairs are really important. The more chairs in your cafe, the more customers you can fit, which means more resources. Furniture has stats too. Okay. So there we go. Now we're in build mode. Okay. So we have 400 materials. Uh, let's build a simple... we then go like up here oh okay hold on I think I see can I how do I undo that okay those are the walls all right wait a second be to return there we go delete okay so what do I do? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so then. Uh, ah, it's 3D. Oh, I can just hold it down. That's good to know. Except I've built it to, I've made it too, I've made it too large. So now I need to come back. Can I get a refund on that? I can, okay. All right, I don't know what I'm doing. So let's try this again. Okay, if it's 10 and I've got, so we just built a very cozy cafe for right now. How about that? Um, Okay, that'll cost me 196. That'll cost me three. Okay, so let's do this. Okay. Uh, now I need a door. Okay. Uh, ooh, two windows. How about a window here? And one here. And then chairs. We have moldy chairs. Ooh. You know what? It's fine. It's totally fine. Um, there. Oh, we need... A, okay, so seats need to face a table. So we need a table first. A crummy table. Wow. Okay. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're starting really small. Okay. Um, a little food bowl. Put a little food bowl over here. 
Uh, we got a rose bush. Oh, I need a sink, don't I? Um, okay, well then we're gonna put the sink here. It's not great. Oh, a dusty rug. That's that's lovely. How about let's actually we're gonna can we move things? Move furniture. Yeah, let's move you down one so that you're not right next to the sink. Okay, and then a rose bush. Do you just? I assume you go outside. Okay. Now, is this like a path? Because I think that'd be adorable. Oh. Okay. Um, I have a, I have a, I have a, I have a pet, I have a cat cafe. Get in here. Oh. Uh, what do you want? You want water. Okay, well, how do I... Menu. <laughs> water! Don't expect any praise. It requires the sink and cooking skill one. Ingredients, thankfully, are just water. Um, so, let's see here. How do I... Oh, take order. Okay. And then prepare the water. And then give you the water. You also want water, so let me take your order. Oh, can I... Let me zoom in so you can see this. Sorry. Uh, let me prepare the water. And here's your water. And everyone's happy because a cat sat on them. Ooh, you're happy. Yay. Very nice. I noticed that I have vagabonds right now, but they're happy vagabonds, and they only asked for water, and they, they, oh, are you good? You all right? Vagabond? I was, I was worried about my cat. Okay. Oh, <gasps> Is this a little witch? Chat. Oh, she wants to chat. Oh, it's a little witch. Hi. Ah. Carla Lala. I find Bruise and Muse as relaxing as a nice long walk. Really? Because it's kind of crummy in here, but I appreciate you saying that. That's very polite. Dusk sets when you hear a raspy meowing outside. When you open the door to see if it's a stray, a dark shape rushes into Bruise and Muse. Uh oh. <gasps> An ancient black cat sits in your cafe, gazing at you with big yellow eyes. Hello. Uh, hi? Not surprised, little thing. You resemble your grandmother, Nain. I'm surprised to find her cat cafe open for business. Your handiwork, I'm sure. The cats which have chosen to shelter here. Their paws are soft, their tummies full, their bristles... bristly. This thing pleases me, little thing. I have something to show you. Follow, if you please. Um, so our option is to go to a shrine. A magical cat showed up at the end of our day and says, follow me to a shrine. I'm sure this is going to work out fine. You follow the dark cat into a clearing hidden deep in the woods. There you find what looks like some sort of ancient shrine. Have you noticed, little thing, how your bruise and muse and its cats have brought delight to the humans of Catterwall? For the sake of this shrine, I ask that you continue to do so. Fill their little hearts with delight and obtain their help in restoring this old shrine to its former glory. Pretty please, yes. Uh, can I get something in return? Little thing, is bringing delight to friendly folk not its own reward? I don't appreciate that call out. You dragged me out here in the middle of the night into the woods 
for some cat shrine. I feel like I should get something. JD Lady, thank you for the resub. Welcome on in. The shrine is powerful for Kenny Cat caretakers. Say that five times fast. Such as yourself, little thing. As the shrine is restored, I'm sure you will enjoy bountiful benefits for your cafe and cats. To start, set a project for yourself. Each project requires goals to be met and a certain amount of delight. Why don't you try starting your project now, little thing? I will find you after you've managed to make some progress. Okay, so these are like upgrades. Hmm. Okay, so I think my first one should be more cats. Oh, no, my first one should be cat comforts. Well, let's find, I mean, so what else I got? Um, food would be unlocking more things. Uh, I'm focused on the cats first. Okay, yeah, I'm going to focus on the cats. So let's, um, let's try cats comforts, level one which will unlock the little litter box, the floral litter box, the cardboard box, and the basic cat bed. Are you sure you want to start the Cat Comforts Level 1 project? I do. I also like that apparently you can unlock everything, so it doesn't look like you restrict yourself if you, you know, do a thing. Um, okay. Do I, can I start another one? Oh, no. All right. Okay. Can I pet the cat? Apparently not. All right, you good? And then I think this attracts stray cats. Oh, you don't have any lures in your inventory. Um, oh, okay, so here's a market. Um, furniture or pet goods. Okay, so we can lure in stray cats with some lures. Uh, we don't... Okay, we haven't unlocked anything else yet. What about the market? Okay, so we could unlock the coffee recipe, because it feels like... Ooh, coffee and espresso. Can we unlock that? Okay. Black coffee requires coffee machine, and black coffee requires coffee beans. Well, we can get some coffee beans... I might need a coffee machine. So is a coffee machine in the furniture place? It is. Here to buy stuff? Cool. Okay, are you like the blacksmith? Are you the are you the, the sassy blacksmith that doesn't like anybody at first? Anyway, I need a coffee machine, so give me it. Thank you. Okay. Um and with that we're gonna return to the cafe. We are going to enter uh, build mode. And we're going to place a coffee machine. Uh, yeah, we'll place it over here. Sorry, cat. I mean, you'll get out of the way shortly, I'm sure. Um, but now we can offer people coffee because it is a cat cafe. You might want to move. Well, Duder, are you good? You're, you're probably, you know what? You're probably fine. It's, it's fine. Um, I should probably put my third chair down, shouldn't I? Okay. And do I have enough to build out another, can I build out more wall? Like another, that'll cost me 64. Okay, so let's see. What about this? 68. Okay, so no. Sorry, no alcove. Um, Zach, hey, welcome on in. I see Zach is over on YouTube. Hello. Uh, we are playing Cat Cafe Manager. Um, for those watching on Twitch or YouTube, uh, they sent over a key because their Kickstarter for the sequel launches tomorrow. Um, so let's see here. Uh, I'm going to move... I'm going to move that now that I can... How do I move furniture? Uh, 
There we go. And we'll move the cat food to the corner. And we'll put the sink next to the coffee machine. That feels better. Okay, because now we've got this stuff down here, actually. No, I feel like you probably can't get it. You know, it's fine. Um, let's do this. That way we'll have the coffee machine, the sink in the corner. We'll have the cat up there and the cafe stuff down here. Hopefully we'll make enough. Oh, what are our stats? We have one rug, one piece of tech, lots of space, cat food. Oh, and eventually we'll be able to design elements. So, okay. All right, so let's stop moving the furniture. Let's exit design mode. Let's go ahead and skip to morning. Wait, you didn't like what I, what? You didn't ask me for anything. Oh, you want there to be two cats. Or a cat didn't. Okay, so a cat didn't talk to you, so you're upset. Um, hello, Saxton over on Twitch. And uh, yeah, we've been streaming for about, what? What did we start? 3.30? About 45 minutes playing this. Um, okay, so... All right. That is fine. Our rank is D. Maybe we'll do better next next day. Okay. I want to be able to pet the cat. How do I pet the cat? Oh, my. oh, we have a customer. What would you like? You would like some water. Well, let me go get your water. I love that to prepare water, you still get, like, the frying pan out. Okay. And you probably want the cat to come over, right? Hello? Okay, you got your... And you get your cat. Oh my goodness, he makes a pss -pss noise. Okay, water. Here's your water. All right. I like your purple beard. That's nice. Oh my goodness, you got two visits from the cat. You are blessed. Okay, and you want water. I got you. I got you, buddy. You want water? I got you. There you go. Well, they're enjoying themselves. That's good. Got to clean up some stuff. Okay. Got another customer who wants some water. Okay, so it starts out very simple. Uh, maybe I bought that. Maybe I bought the coffee machine too fast. Um, oh, staff. So here's a new thing. It's tough to run the cafe just by yourself, so try hiring some staff to help out. Each staff member is good at different things. So they can take care of cats, they can make nice food, they can fix appliances, they can talk to customers or clean the cafe. And you will slowly earn staff training points, which you can spend to level up your staff. To hire new staff members, you'll first have to perform the staff hiring project at the shrine. Once this is done, go to the town's notice board where you will find many looking for a job. Okay, so we can hire one staff initially, but there are other projects to increase your staff slots. Okay, so right now it's just me, and that's fine. I could really use more cats, is the thing. Um, but you are very happy because the cat visited you. So nice. Okay, you're a vagabond. Let's take your order. Get your order. Give your order. Okay, satisfaction immediately went up two-thirds. And how about you, buddy? Are you good? What more would you like? You'd probably like there to be more than one cat. I'm going to work on getting more than one cat in here. Okay. I also appreciate that there's no judgment on serving these customers. Like, their names are Vagabond, but you know what? We have a cat cafe in the middle of a field in nowhere, so the fact that we have customers at all is already pretty amazing. Um, take care, Zach. Enjoy the food. Yeah, snuggle. Snuggle, snuggle, snuggle. Oh my goodness, look at you playing. Oh, you're so cute. Also, this cat cafe just opened, so to be fair, 
the best thing you can order is probably water because you don't even know if I know how to make anything. I'll have a water, sure. Uh oh, the witch is back. Me and this fox had a lovely chat the other day. Um, not that I can understand any of her weirdly cute well yelping. Well, what does the fox say? We're not doing that. Oh, and you... See, the thing is, you're leaving without anything happening. Um, hey, Brian, welcome on in. Do you have the recipe for ice? Um, no. Okay, I, I don't think I can... Oh, I don't have any lures. All right, that's fine. Um, so I bought when I didn't need to. But now at night is when we can... Oh, can I... Actually, wait a second. How do I go to the town? Can I buy anything else in the furniture? Oh, I can. Oh, okay. I can upsta upstage. Upgrade my table to a basic table, uh, which is a hipster. There's a magic chair, which is fantasy. Or there's a pub chair, which is pub style. Let's go... Let's go hipster. Strange painting. Okay, so no. Okay, so yeah, we can upgrade the uh, the chair. And then pet goods. Um, let's get a lure. And then the market. If we're going hipster, then we should probably get an herbal tea recipe. But we need herbs, right? Okay, so let's get herbs. Okay. Um, the shrine, we currently have one project going and we need a hundred delight from our customers to uh, upgrade the cafe. So let's go ahead, let's go to build mode real quick. Um, can we swap out the table? Oh, okay, put that there. Um, how do I, oh, move furniture. Okay, how do I, ah, put it back in the, oh, okay. I can sell it. Or I can put it in my inventory. We'll do that. Oh, that was the rug. I wanted to... Okay. I'll put the rug back. Okay. Um, and staff. Right now it's just me. I am level one. Do I have a training point? Oh, I can train up in something. Um... I'm gonna train up in. Hmm. Oops. Hold on. I've lost. There we go. Um. I'm gonna train up in service. Okay. Skip to morning. Whoa. Not bad. Um. Everybody who came was happy, except for the witch who I feel like we're not. Satisfying whatever she needs yet. Um, so let's see here. I believe Cat Cafe Manager, I'm playing it on Steam. Hey, Tanya, welcome on in. Uh, it's also available on the Switch. Uh, let me confirm that. <laughs> let's see here. Yeah, I see it out for, uh, sit out for on Steam and Switch. And... Um, so yeah, it's on both of those. Uh, I did, I was talking to Wireless Riot, who is going to, who's going to, uh, make sure their Switch is charged so they can play. Um, all right, so, hopefully this is enough to start us getting a little bit more happiness. Um, so we still need about 58 more Delight before, zoom out a little, uh, oh, let's say zoomed in. Oh, maybe we'll actually get to talk to you today before you leave. Carla Lala. Um, hello. Oh dear, I have been so excited to meet you, Herb. I am Carla Lala. Please call me Carla, or Lala, or both. I run the Pet Emporium in town. We carry many useful items for cat owners, such as cat food or litter boxes. I hope you can find the time to pay us a visit. I love your hat, Lala. I do. Oh dear. I'd recommend not commenting on a witch's hat, Herb. I can't speak for all garden witches, but it's embarrassing. Well, then why are you wearing it? Okay, you know what? 
So noted. Thank you for setting your boundaries. I understand. Quite a few garden witches live here in Catterwall, please. No hat-related talk when they visit Brews and Muse, alright? Good, good. Us witches tend to pay in scrumptious nectar. Many merchants at the food market enjoy it so much they'll only accept nectar as payment for their recipes and ingredients. If you wish to stock Brews and Muse with new drinks and foods, I recommend you, advi you advertise to witches and collect some nectar herb. Advertise to witches, get nectar, buy food, buy ingredients, buy recipes, don't talk about hats. Got it. Personally, I look forward to visiting Brews and Muse more often. I hope we can talk more then. Oop. Okay, so we met Carla Lala and unlocked a new resource. Uh, oh, I, I cannot... I mean... I can give you tea. I can't I can't give you a pretzel yet. Okay, so now we learn about the types of customers. There are six different types of groups of customers. Each has unique needs and pays using a different resources. Vagabonds pay in fabric, artists in jewels, punks in materials, witches in nectar, fisher folk in fish, and business people in gold. Use the advertising menu to select which customer groups visit the cafe. This can be useful if you want to earn specific resources quickly. And here are the customer's needs. Wowzers. Hey, Amalia. Okay, so cats. All cat stats of this customer type are added together, except for unhappy cats. Uh, hunger. Uh, comfort. Social. The toilet, which eventually we'll have space for, the space of your cafe, the size of your cafe, and furniture needs. Okay. All right. Well, hopefully you enjoy that. Where's get, enjoy your herbal tea. You want water? I got you. Okay. You got visited by the cat. You've got them given your water. Be happy and leave me some delight. Because there's a weird cat god, I think, in the woods that uses your happiness for their fuel, I think. Oh, hey. Carla says, please stop by the Pet Emporium soon. I don't really, I really don't have many other customers. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I can't make you a pretzel, but I can give you tea. Uh, can I, oh, can I actually go to town now? and buy pretzels? Pretzel recipe. Okay, and then I need bread. Okay, back to the cafe. All right, you're happy at least. You're probably, I mean, I know you wanted more, but I don't have, I don't have more. All right, I'll get you water. It's a bit like, um. You know, it's also a bit like the chef games where you have to run back and forth and get stuff um, and serve it up. Which are always fun and chaotic, but also make me so nervous. Mm. We have somebody who wants stuff. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, pretzel. Pretzel. Cool. And uh, hello, girl named Chris. Welcome on in. Alright, you're happy. Do you need a cat visit to make you happier? There you go. Get on in that lap. Oh my goodness, yes. So good. Alright, you're happy. How are you doing? Oh, well, three. That's not bad. All the witches are here, and funnily enough, none of them are wearing hats. But you do want me to have more cats, which I totally understand. I gotta... I gotta, I gotta get to the more cat stage. But first I gotta get stuff for... I gotta get stuff like for my cats. Oh shoot, did somebody leave? Oh, rude. Now I gotta check out here. Did anybody else leave any junk out here? Uh, who leaves materials? Because I'm going to need to 
punks pay materials. Okay, because I'm going to need to get more materials to expand my cafe. Wait, can I... How much to expand my cafe this way? Nope. Okay, no can do. I... Wait, hold on. 17. Oh my goodness, I'm so close. But that's okay. Um, enjoy the Lurk Alien Traveler. Hey, Super Rider Andy, welcome on in. Um, I got caught up. I got caught up in my uh, my Katniss. Not not Katniss Everdeen, but that might be the name of one of our cats next. Um, so we are getting a friendship level higher with Carla Lala, but otherwise, um, our satisfaction level could be better. You really need me. I need to have more cats, is the thing. Um, so I'm going to... I bought some lures, so I'm going to place a lure. Because we clearly need more cats. Got your order. I somehow made a pretzel out of thin air. Imagine just coming to a cafe and being like, yes, I'll have one of your pretzels, please. And a cat cuddle. All right, here we go. Strays and adoption. Let's try adopting some cats. So first off, we did buy a stray lure. We placed the lure in the stray food bowl. We pet stray cats to gain their trust, and then we can adopt them. Um, okay, your cat, your cat, your cafe. You can only hold as many cats in your cafe as you have cat slots. You won't be able to adopt new strays if you are at your max. To free up space in your cafe, you'll have to give your cats a forever home. So once we unlock the notice board, we'll be able to essentially adopt out our cats and give them a forever home. That's nice. But they'll only adopt a cat with the stats they're looking for, much like actual adoption. Which I think people shouldn't be so picky if they want a cat in their life. It's just my personal opinion. Here's your water. There's a cat. Oh my goodness. You look like an entire mess. Oh, you, because you're a mess. Um, and you're a party cat. You're a chill cat. Ooh, and you share, but you're 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 a party cat. Okay, so. Okay, so we pet them, and they. Oh, did we miss a customer? I hope not. Yeah, I definitely need to get some staff. I'm busy petting cats. I wonder if we'll get different outfits. All right, you're happy. Uh, we are close to getting that satisfaction level for the cat comforts. At which way we'll be able to... Um, oh, more customers. I still love that to make water and serve it, I'm doing a thing with, like, the pan. You good? You good, witch? Oh, come here. It's hard to... Um, hey, Chrysacom, welcome back. I hope that you're feeling well. Um, we currently have one cat. But we did lure in some more cats. And we pet one, so we're gaining the cat's trust. Okay, are you good? What's okay? So your satisfaction is not great because you want more pet, you want more cats. I get it. I do. All right, and you just want water. Still sparkling your tap. I'm just gonna go with tap. Is that good? Tap good? Yeah, tap is probably fine. Okay, 
So the witches would be happier if we had more cats. I mean, who wouldn't? There's your pretzel, fool. Some stray cats have come looking for food. Okay, we're still gonna we're gonna work on you. Okay. Oh, you're new. Who are you? Finley. Uh, hi, uh, I hope it's okay to say, the work you're doing here is inspiring, honestly. Lots of work ahead, I think, but thank you. I'll just accept the compliment and not try to deflect it for a change. How about that? Hey, no problem. I mean it. I'm Finley. I, uh, I make music. Not like for money, unless you count my mom's Patreon sub. Whoa, <laughs> too real. Bet you didn't think there'd be many artists in Catterwall. Lots of creative folk moved here to focus on work. Brews and Muse is chill. I bet they'd love it. Us artists can hook you up with jewels. The craftsmen over at Gruff Decorations. Oh, Gruff Decorations, because the, the guy's mean. He's gruff. I get it. Uh, they charge jewels for most of their furniture. So if you're looking to furnish your cafe, advertise to artists and get yourself some jewels, okay? I looked down and saw Amalia's comment, and I... Mm. Mm -hmm. Do you happen to have any coffee? If not, don't forget to buy the coffee machine at Gruff's after you buy the recipe. I do have coffee. Do, do you want coffee? I really enjoy working on my stuff here, and I hope I can get to know you a little better, too, if that's cool with you. That is cool. Same here. Till next time, then. Okay, we met Finley, and we've unlocked Jules. Okay, so regulars. Sorry. It's that time. Apologies. Making a wonderful cat cafe is important, of course, but so is making friends along the way. Regulars are colorful townsfolk who will keep visiting your cafe. As they visit and gain delight, you'll fill up their friendship bar. Every time this fills up, you'll go up a friendship level. Certain shrine upgrades are also locked until you reach a certain friendship level with any one of your regulars. Regulars will also visit on their own, but if you want to meet a specific person, use the phone booth to give them a call. Oh, that's nice. That's like, oh, you want coffee? I got you. I... Oh, how are you liking life in the boonies, Herb? Oh, wait, no, come back. I, you, I, I had your coffee. I... Okay. I'm going to go to the, sorry, I'm, I'm going to go to the shrine. No, how do I? All right. Okay. Uh, let me see my menu. I'm pretty good on ingredients. Um, can I actually advertise? I love it. Tabby cats, tab water, all the basics. We'll model for snacks. Find your Mew Muse. Don't have a familiar? Get familiar with our cats. Let's go with artists. Um, okay, so are there any strays? No, I need some lures, don't I? I do. Let's go buy some lures. Uh-huh. There we go. Got some lures down. Oh my goodness, and she's so cute. Okay, let's skip to morning. Rank D. We're gonna we're working on it. We're working on it. What about um Okay, so how do I How do I turn in? Oh. What's up, buddy? Hello, Herb. Figured I'd come check in and see how you were doing. How have you been, then? Uh, it's been a dream to help the cats. 
but also thanks to you for helping out, so thank you. It's my pleasure, really. Just happy to have been here at the start of something great. Say, I've been talking to some of my fisher folk friends. Say they're keen to visit Bruise and Muse. Fisher folk are like myself, straightforward fair <laughs> straightforward folk who sometimes prefer paying in fish. Don't give me that look, it's a town tradition. Things being, Carla Lala of the Pet Emporium could use all the fish she can get her witchy hands on. Sells her finest cat wares for fish alone. So if you want to treat your cats, or buy lures to attract new strays, you might want to advertise to fisher folk and catch yourself some fish. Like they say, teach a man to befriend a fisherman and they'll have fish for a lifetime. <laughs> okay, so now we have unlocked a new resource, fish. Okay, so now, oh, what do you want? You want tea? No, oh, you want, oh, sorry, buddy. It's not exactly what you wanted. I apologize. Oop, some stray cats are here. Okay, nope, first let me get your order. Okay, hopefully the cat will make you feel better. Let me win some trust. Okay. Is that enough to win your trust? <gasps> We're adopting a new stray cat. Okay, you've won this cat's trust. They would like to be adopted. Go ahead and give them the perfect name. Ooh. You're a party cat, so I'm going to call you Harley. Ahoy. And we completed a project. Okay, so um, select a new project. Okay, so we could increase the cat limit slot, which I feel like is important. Um, we could unlock cold brew. Ooh, oh, sandwiches. I do love a sandwich. Um, oh, we should unlock the community notice board so we can add staff. Let's do that first. Okay, so we need to make people happy. Ain't a fan of these tall buildings spreading up lately. Peg legs walk stairs about as well as eels drive tiny eel-sized cars. Uh, okay. Alright, so now I have two cats. Get in here and there we go. Befriend that customer. Okay, the witches might be happier now because they'll get to pet two cats. Oh my goodness, the cat yeah, is yeah, so cute. Okay. Oh, you're an artist. What do you want? You want black coffee. I got you. But actually, while we're here, if I can afford it, let's go get some more recipes. Um, I can afford black tea and espresso. And I need tea leaves. So I think I'm pretty good for now. Now I should be able to serve anything somebody wants. I hope. Oh. I always find it funny, like, what do people go for in pet names? So, like, do they go for an actual name? Do they go for something silly, like a concept? Um, you know, like if somebody calls their pet, like, Biscuit or something, you know. But food seems to be another popular thing. Okay, we got plenty of cats. Get your pretzel. I should buy some. Um, ooh, maybe I can go to town and buy um, some more chairs. So do we go with a magic chair or a pub chair? Should we just be really weird and do magic chairs? Oh, we can apparently just, okay, great. Fine. Um, Let's throw another chair down. Fantasy. And then I think I... 
I don't think I can put the chair down because it needs to be facing a table, so I need to get another table. Um, I could make the sad table, I guess. Oh, hold on, first off, take your order. Serve you up. Let's go talk to the cats. Oop, hold on, somebody left a mess on here. Um, can I do, oh good, I can get it from over here. Um, all right, win the cat, win the trust of cats. Um, okay. You don't need a lot of food. You're chill. You're a sharer. We like people who share, so we'll get you next. Okay. Um, we were going to try and add another table here. Ooh, maybe, can we put a table like next to the window? It'll be the kind of table that I really like to have in a restaurant. It's like right next to the window and I can just sit there and enjoy the light and not be like seeing people and then just read my book. So let's try that. Let's add another seat. This is really turning into a hipster cafe because it's just got the jankiest like, oh yeah, there's a style there and a style over there. You know, it's fine. It's totally fine. Don't worry about it. Rank D, okay, that's fine. We're, we're working it out. Um, I have more chair slots? I don't have more chairs. Oh, I'm, I'm out of chairs, buddy. Oh, hi, you're the cutest. Um, okay, I think I can upgrade, can I? Yes, okay, so I can train in something. And that levels me up. Uh, cooking? Fixing, service, cleaning. Ooh, cooking. We'll speed up our cooking. And then our cats. Oh my goodness, can we train our cats? <gasps> oh, we can train our cats. Okay, well, you were my first and you were a vagabond cat, so we'll give you that. And then... You, oh, we can't train you yet. Oh, you're both, wait, I thought you, no. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Um, take care, Ariana, enjoy, and thank you. Okay, we got a, we got a customer who wants a thing. Got you, pretzels. What I really need is I need punks because I need to expand my shop because I'm running out of space. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to move the kitty treats over here. I'm going to take this one chair and move it here. And then when she's gone, I am going to move that chair down to the bottom so I can run around a little easier because Clean up cat pee. I'm trying to run an establishment here. I can't have you peeing all over the place. This is why I need to unlock the... Um, oh, wait. Silly me. Pet goods. Oh, I need a lot of money for that litter box. But I could buy a cat bed. I need a lot for that litter box. But I will buy a cardboard box. Because that's just... That's only fair. Hi, hello. Are you a... What are you? Hi. Mateo. Mm. A mysterious stranger drifts into Catterwall. Collecting the town's stray cats under one roof? Driven by what? Witchery? Ridiculousness? Business acumen? Driven by my sudden desire to leave this conversation. No. Driven by my grandma, I guess? Uh, aren't we all in some way? Please note that in the kind of cool stuff I've said, 
but don't quite understand list. Thanks, babe. Wow. After you left the city, you thought you'd never see someone talk to their phone assistant again. You figure there's always that one guy. Name's Mateo, friendo. You must be a business person. You know, I'm somewhat of a business person myself. Business people are just looking to blow off some steam from their high pressure and very important jobs and don't mind spending some valuable gold. Deluxe furniture can only be purchased using gold. Obviously, if you want the good stuff, best advertised to business people. Please add Bruise and Muse to the Hey, That's Neat list. Oh, also add Bruise and Muse to the Hey, Cats list. Thanks. I'll definitely pop back in here later, friendo. Now back to the grind with you. Toodles. Okay, so now we've unlocked gold. And if we get business people in, they'll do that. All right. I can take your order. Can I serve it up? Take your order. Serve it up. Uh, decorate. Remove some furniture. We gotta fix the coffee machine because it broke down. Okay. Fix the coffee machine. There we go. Alright. Are some stray cats around? Not yet. Do I need some lures? I'm out of lures. Let's go get some lures. Okay. Hello. Hey, pal, friendo, chap. I'm focus testing new nicknames. Um, just leave, please. Oh, goodness, we have business people. Oh, no, not with the finger guns. Okay, so business people want black coffee. Stray cats. Okay, we were getting uh, one because they share their food. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's almost time for me to take another break. Oh, who dropped a ba- I don't even serve bananas. Who dropped a banana peel? Okay, the end of the day is coming soon, seems like. A ticking clock in games is always, like, that's always stressful for me. Even though I know that's just, like, days go by. Just like the song. It's a good song. Um, but yeah, I'm always like, oh, I gotta do everything before the clock runs out. Okay, so I'm almost enough. I almost have enough delight to get the staff hiring board. Oh, I was so close. Okay, we'll skip to morning. Okay, we're doing better. The witches are, like, satisfaction is better. Um, vagabonds are 100%. So, vagabonds through the roof. Witches. Okay, if you didn't get visited by a cat, then you're not happy. So, I need, I need more cats as well. Um, okay. And I guess, oh, I can call somebody if I want. Maybe. Who? What? I gotta worry about all the... Tra I gotta worry about this entire space with trash? Alright, well, let me... I mean, I'm not... I'm barely even built out here, pal. Alright. We are still attempting to win over this cat. This cat has the name Debra. Actually, I'm going to do that Debra because Debra Wilson, who is awesome. All right, and she shares her food. All right, so let's place the lure. Oh, nope. Okay. Uh, sorry, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Get 
in the right spot. There we go. All right, now you're the grumpy, you're the grumpy furniture guy. Oh, hey, new kid. <gasps> welcome on in, Raiders. Hello, DC. Welcome in. Um, I'm actually going to take a short break in just a moment. You're doing that thing people do to me when they want to chat. Where they open their mouths and words tumble out at me. That thing. I'm Arwell. Don't bother introducing yourself, okay? Won't take long before you're out of here anyways. I'm gonna go full Midwestern. Happy to meet ya! God, smiling that much doesn't hurt at all? You wouldn't make much of a punk. That's right, I'm a punk. No, a couple other punks too. We're pretty cool. Me and my punk pals, we're low on cash, but we scrounge up lots of sweet materials. And if you want to expand this dump, you're gonna need yourself some materials. At least, that's what I'd say if I wanted to give helpful yet slightly obnoxious advice. Uh-huh. You're not the worst. You can tumble words at me later if you like. Okay, so now we've unlocked materials. Oh, okay. I, not now. Uh, adds four chimit, no, four chimit, four limit chair slot, unlocks various pieces of modern furniture. Let's do that. I'm just trying to make some tea for the customer. You want some coffee. You want some coffee. This Mateo dude won't leave me alone. How can one human contain that many words? Seriously, like you're doing that thing when people want to talk to me and then words come out of their mouth. Okay. Uh, does the mess, ah, there we go. Note board. Okay, looking for job. Let's hire somebody for service first. Um, cooking. I am positively excellent at swapping at swatting commoners who don't who do not uphold proper decorum. I don't know about that. The Earth Mother has told me to. Uh, my dad owned a bar, so I know my way around them. I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll go, or we'll try you. We'll try you out. Don't be weird about it. Okay. All right. I've now. Oh, good. Now you're handling that. What? Oh, you can't get there. Is that? Okay, so I need to move. Oh, we're out of coffee beans. All right, hold on. I think I need to move. First off, let me just check. Sorry, I'm still checking work because I'm apparently a sucker. Um, okay, Sirius, welcome on in. Hello. Okay, now let's move some furniture around. Let's move the cardboard box over here. That way it's out of everybody's way. And you should be able to get to everything now. Yep, let me clean this cat pee up. Sorry about that. Okay, there we go. Now we have somebody who is actively taking orders. Did you get your order taken? Oh, because I'm out of... Hold on. I'm out of stuff. Wait a second. That's not exactly what you wanted. I need to go to town and order some more coffee. I appreciate, though, that it tells you, like, you're serving coffee, but you need coffee beans. So let's actually get one of everything. Now we can't afford stuff. That's fine. 
Okay. But we are we are earning stuff a little faster. Um, our delight. Oh my goodness. So many cats. I don't have any lures. That's fine. I, I, I've got all the cats I can handle right now. Okay, do I pay these other employees? Is that is that how that works? Oh, let's look at the notice board to see if anybody is looking to adopt a cat. Okay, gonna leave town soon, but I'd love to have a traveling partner. Anyone know of any vagabond cats with good hiking skills? So will you tell me if the cat... Okay, so you want, you want a cat that has like... Okay. And if I give you one to five... Okay, I'm not ready to give away a cat yet. Not ready yet. I've done a separation. No, not yet. Maybe soon, but not now. Rank B. That's that's better than it's been in a minute. I think we're doing better. Actually, hiring somebody helped because now I can serve people faster. I do. I do like the fact that they are not fighting. They are just. They're just catting. Um, just catting. Just like the... Um, is there any new furniture I should get? A crappy toilet? Um, it feels like a toilet would be a good thing to have. I just don't know where I'm going to put it. Um, is it just like a standing... Is it like inside or outside? I don't... Okay, so it's got to go inside. Ooh. Okay, I think what I need to do then is I need to build out space here. Must be doing well if you're flush enough to add a toilet. Oh. Actually, let's do this. There we go. Alright, just in case. Just in case anybody needs it. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, pause. Let me save the game because I have not done that. Uh, let me head back to the main menu for just a minute. No, don't quit the game. Oh, oops. I quit the entire game because I'm not smart. But yeah, once you hire staff, it's like... Thankfully, nobody needed a bathroom yet. So that's nice. But what I'm going to do, because it's, of course, it's bothering me. Bothering me? Sure. Is expand the cafe out this way. That way it's all symmetrical. And when I do get another table, I can make like a single, like a little single server there. Um staff do I did you level up again you did mm, okay oh I get to pick a new trait for myself at level five I can be a neat freak a grease monkey or a hipster plus two to all skills when at least four pieces of hipster furniture are present in the cafe yeah we'll do that and then we'll increase my ability to uh, train. Okay, so now we need to buy, if we have options, buy hipster furniture. But I don't know if I can afford it. Okay. Duplicate props provide no cafe stats. All right. No, I just need a lot more I need a lot more supplies to get anything else. A cash register? Hmm. Okay. I guess I'll skip to morning. A! I assume that there's probably still, like, perhaps the S rank. But I'll take a rank in A, because that's the first A we've gotten all game. A! 
How adorable. Okay, I could probably use some... Let me get some lures for... Yeah, I still need... I need gold. I need to advertise to frickin' business people. Ugh. Business people pay with gold. That's fine. Oh, I can advertise to... Oh, my silly. Okay, I sadly have enough Vagabond, so let me turn that off. I need gold and materials. I'm going to turn off witches for right now. Actually, I'll turn off, yeah, because I need... All right, so it's turning them off that does it, not, not activating them. Got it. leveled up. I leveled up again? Jeez. I'm getting kind of good at this. Uh, let's level up my cooking skill. So the cats have levels and the people have levels. We can call a regular show up, so let's call up somebody. Um, Finley was fun. Hey, thanks for calling. I'll be right over. Finley's fun. Uh, they make music. Finley. Oh, clean the bathroom. Did someone use the toilet? Skippity and all? Go serve. I still don't quite understand the skibbity thing. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna, just gonna let it be something I do not get. Okay, so now we have unlocked ham sandwich, veggie sandwich, simple salad, and more ingredients. So let's select a new project. First was cats, so we can add two more cats to the because obviously we gotta add more cats. Obviously. I, it's, it's a thing because I feel like people do try to stay up on and understand like, okay, what does this mean? But because the language and the speed of language and evolution is, is happening so fast, it really is like, I don't know what that word means. That sounds like a made up word. And I guess I know all words are made up, but still. I work part-time at Hawkable Coffee. It's the pits, but I gotta make rent somehow. And as many bland blends as I can drink. I'm willing to bet that there is probably an actual job that is cultural consultant to make sure that artists who need it are kept up on trends. Like, there's gotta be, there's gotta be people out there who are, who are simply like, just like we as Generation X set the set the time on the VCR, there's got to be somebody out there right now who's like, I got you. Here's what this means. Here's how it works. Here's how you use it. And here's how you definitely don't use it. And here's when it's over. Like, if you use it after this, then it's over. And that's the best part, because AI can never do such a thing. Because if AI thinks you want to hear that word, and if AI thinks you want that word to be valid, AI is going to say, no, it's totally, it's totally a word. Um, did my cats level up too? Who leveled up? 
bubbles. Let me give you an extra vagabond ability. Okay, I only had... Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. They are. Um, uh, Eustacia Vi, when I was at Fax Unplugged last year, gave me this polish. Uh, it's Hollow Taco uh, Circuit Breaker. And I figured I would paint my nails for the trip. Um, Hollow Taco also now makes like a one coat black gloss that I need to get because I don't often do my nails black because it's hard to find a black that is like nice and black black, but that black looked really black, so the black black is gonna black my black black nails. I know, the word black was used a lot, but when I get it, you'll understand because it's like a deep glossy black and it looks really good. Ooh, cream black, I need to stop, no, don't make me start shopping because Huh. The non, like, all these, like, indie stores, like Moon Cat and Hollow Taco, they are always, like, hitting exactly what I want, and I need to stop because I'm just going to have too many, like, polishes around and not make, and not do my nails enough. Okay. Tis a new day. Has the, who left P? I mean, I know it was the cats, but still. Okay, I'm going to zoom out to see, is there anything I need to clean up? Oh, I need coffee beans. Uh, let me buy some coffee beans then. Let me also, oh, I can't afford, uh, hold on. I need some tea leaves, tea, tea leaves. Um, okay. Everyone good? I got you, fool. I got you. I got you. Just serve it up. Okay, more artists. Artists mean gems. That's good. Gems really outrageous. Take her order. Getting, dialing in the right, uh, sometimes with a controller what I'm using is getting the right um, place to hit is sometimes not as easy. I've never, I've, I've gone out to get a manicure one time and this was back when, this is back when um, like masculine people weren't really getting manicures. So they weren't basically giving us the same level of neutral care that they would other people, so it wasn't as much fun. Like, my nails were definitely not done as well as they could have been. So now I would probably would enjoy going out for a manicure. Um, oops, hold on, there's pee on the floor. Hey, can somebody, can you clean that up? We have more cats. Okay. Um, okay, this will have a basic food bowl. Premium canned stray lure. Now let's just go. Let's go with the first basic levels first. Okay, there's advanced brews. Um, more seats. Maybe more seats. Yeah, more seats. And we can call somebody. Can we call Tyrone? Did you pee on the floor? Oh, buddy, you okay? What am I feeding you? Smelly cat, smelly cat. Okay, uh, let's call Bonner since Bonner helped us out. <laughs> ah, you sound ready for a story. Coming right up. Um, I can understand also being afraid of injury. I, I have seen more than enough stories about people who... Um, people who were injured or simply ended up ended up not having a great experience because of the fact that implements need to be cleaned and maybe implements weren't cleaned when they should be cleaned and so yeah I won't go into details because you can already pretty much figure it out but yeah hey buddy I'll get your order myself So it's interesting, you can call a regular to show up and they come and they get their order and they're all happy, but they don't 
talk to you while they're there. They probably talk to you as they leave. Yeah. I hear the city has even more cars than Catterwall does. I take it city folks just wear earplugs all day. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we do. All day. The townsfolk, filled with delight, have helped a lot in restoring the cat shrine. You decide to go take a look. A pair of eyes peer at you from the edge of the clearing. <gasps> Greetings once more, little thing. I see you have taken my advice to heart. An unexpected turn of events? Humans tend to ignore a cat's advice. As a reward, I will answer but one of the little thing's questions, which no doubt quiver upon its inquisitive lips. I'm going to ask, what are you? <laughs> Do you know the old human saying, black cats bring ill fortunes? I am as old as this saying. I am the Grimalkin. The grim days to which I owe my name are long gone, however. Now, I simply look after the cats of this small valley, and this shrine. But I have lacked the strength to do so for some time now. For restoring the shrine, you deserve my thanks. I shall place many dead birds at your door. Okie dokie! A kill-accepting human is a good human in my book. Not that I can write. That is enough questions for meow. I will seek you out again once this shrine is looking more restored. And one more thing, little thing. Keep your eyes on those hawks. Those hawkable acquisitions humans. It is not the first time such humans came to this valley, and it did not end well that time either. Rather than leave, it seems as if the light in the clearing fades for a moment, after which the black cat is simply gone. Okay, that's a thing. Um, all right, we can, I think we can train the staff up. So we'll train you up. Uh, that. Okay, and, oh, I didn't mean to end the day, but that's okay. Um, earnings are pretty good. Okay, we didn't get any punks this, this, this here on this day. Did I, wait, did I say not for... Okay, we're going to advertise to everybody now. Everybody's welcome. I also really love... Hey, King Sundu, welcome on in. I, I love the fact that every advertising has its own has its own like thing. So for punks, put on these leather, go leather gloves. You will get scratched. For the fishermen, these fishy cats will catch your heart. And for the business people, cats and coffee. Now that's synergy. Ugh. Okay, so let's have everybody visit today. How is my menu doing? I've got... I need to get more coffee beans. Can I afford more coffee beans? I can. Oop, who left paper on the floor? I can call it regular. Okay. I like that I can leave the place and it's fine. Um, let's call Arwell because I guess I've been inspired to appreciate the grumpy back blacksmith. Sure, fine. Yeah, okay. Get your grumpy ass in here. Okay, I have two training points, so I will use them to train up Ethan, who should get a new trait. Okay. I'm going to give you the cleaning skill and level you up in it. That way, hopefully, if you see dirt on the floor, you will process it.
Did everyone get their orders? So the more you level up your skills, the faster you do something. That's nice. Um, all right. I know witches want pretzels. Yeah, the the happiness is going up very quickly now that we have we have lots of lots of cats, fast service, and plenty of options. Okay, so now we get more seats. Um, so we can add four chairs now. Uh, let's see here. We'll do more food. Oh, hold on. Can I do more service? Have one regular relationship at level two and adds a staff limit slot. I would like to have more staff, but I suspect I can get these extra food ingredients first. So let's do that. You're doing the things with the words again. Ugh, take a hike, kid. Barwell stares you down. Staring contest. Okay, okay, I get it. Stop freaking me out. I'm not easily scared off, huh? No, I'm not. If you're gonna stick around, I got thoughts. The cats are badasses, but honestly, I can't with the food here. I'll take any help I can get. Fine, it's like this. This grub lacks oomph, funk, chutzpah. It doesn't crawl up my throat and yell, here I am, I am food, you will eat me, or something. Okay. It's half-assed, but it's real close to full-assed. You gotta grab that full-ass by the horns, you feel? I, 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 I picking up what you're putting down, Arwell. That's right, you do. Cooking's all about feeling, you know. Look, kid, I'll be honest with you. This town's in trouble. It's that hockey bowl corporation. They've been getting their dirty talons all up in everyone's business. I'll be first to admit, I ain't clever enough to figure out what all they're planning on doing, but I know I ain't gonna like it. Well, we gotta stop them. We gotta stop them somehow. Hey, quit stealing my cool line. But you're right, pal. This town's the pits, a total hole. But it's my hole, damn it. What I'm saying. <laughs> ah! What I'm saying is, the way this cafe is going, Hawkable's just gonna buy you up like the rest of this darn town. That's why you gotta do something about this food. And I guess I'll help. Now shut up and pay attention. Arwell spent some time talking about cooking techniques. You're not sure you got it all, but appreciate his enthusiasm. And we got a pretty girl gun cat model. Uh, okay. And because our friendship with our will reach level two, <clears throat> we got our needs increased. Um, sorry, the needs for punk. Oh, sorry, my bad. We get more materials from punks, but now they're going to want more things. They're going to want three cats instead of two. And they're going to start wanting root beer and cold brew coffee. So I better learn to make that real soon. Um, well, now what I could do is I could stop inviting punks to the cafe, which would probably stop them needing stuff I don't have. Um, now, why was I inviting punks? Yeah, see, that's the problem is punks now want root beer. And... I cannot help you with root beer, so I'm going to need to tell punks not to show up for a little while. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, punks. You're doing really well, but it's, it's going to hurt because 
I mean, I'll take the order, but I don't have that. So you're gonna get something else, and you're not gonna like it. it is not gonna be what you want. What you really, really want. And I'm sorry about that. Okay, my cats have leveled up. So you weren't disappointed with the fact that I gave you herbal tea. It just wasn't the best. And are you stuck? Yeah, um, Ethan might be stuck. Okay, so first off, we got a decoration. Wait, it's an entire ass statue? Like, just a whole statue? I guess we'll put it here? Wait, can I, I, I can I move you outside? No. I, oh, I could put you I could put you right in the way of the No, we're not doing that. I guess we'll put you here. Now we're becoming a nerd cafe, I guess. Uh build cost. Oh, I could round off my corners. That's not what I wanted to do. That is. There we go. And now I will move you into the corner. Okay, let's see here. We can level up a cat. So let's level up Debra. Let's see here. Ooh, interesting. 10% on all resources for every artist in your cafe, because this cat is a natural muse. Or Aristocat. If it's not exactly the Ritz, why bother? You add more business people, but you add... I'm going to make you an artist cat. Um, and you can be good for business people, but I don't want you to be super good. And Harley, we're going to train you up. You're just going to be a pretty cat. All the artists are going to love you. Okay, and I can't train up anybody else. Uh, let's go to town. Um, since I can't do both sandwiches, I'm going to start with a simple salad. But it requires a fridge. So before I do that, I can afford a fridge. Can I afford any hipster stuff? I can afford hipster things as well. I can afford a hipster fridge. Okay. Uh, where will this fridge go? Mm, I'm gonna put the fridge here and then I'm gonna move the bathroom just because I don't like that. We'll move the bathroom over here. And then we'll put the we'll put the cat's food down here, and the cardboard box can be here. Okay. All right. Skip to morning. Oh, rank A. I'll take it. And we leveled up our friendship with our will. can call a regular. Uh, let's call... Um, I think Finley is probably ready. And Finley sounds like works for Hawkable. Hawkable is very clearly like the evil empire that we are here to take care of or to beat out or something. The cat god even said so. The cat god's like, yeah, you keep an eye on them. I'll take your order myself. Or I won't. Wow, okay. I've made my it's, it's I've I've made my staff too efficient. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. 
I'm just gonna sit here and do nothing, I guess. Oh, let me, I, are you gonna fill the cat food too? You're not, okay. At least I can do that. We are getting delight much faster now. Everybody is super happy. All right, friendship up with Finley. Hey, Gunnar, what's good? Bruce and Muse is a really nice spot to work on my music, it turns out. Hope this isn't too forward, but I know you only got just I know you only just got started at Bruce and Muse, but so far, what are you most proud of? I'm proud of the the decor. For real? That's surprising, but kind of rad. Gotta be nice to create this little spot folks can really relax in, huh? Oh, it would be my dream to actually have a cafe. I wish my music could help folks relax as well. But I know I ain't there yet. Gotta work harder. I always get fired up when I'm around people who inspire me, you know? Folks like you, or my big sis. You might hear Bonner mention Erin, my sis. She used to play piano at his home. She'd visit Bruise and Moose if she could, I think. But she lives a few villages over now. Can you imagine there are towns even more secluded than Catterwall around here? And she just had to move to one? She's why I got into music, you know. She works wonders with a piano. I haven't heard her play in... in a while now. Well, I'm sure she's proud you are working so hard. Really? You know, I've never given it a second thought. Or first one, at that. I haven't actually told her I'm working on my own music, but once I make a track good enough, I'll be sure to let her hear it. Alright, I'm fired up. I'm gonna make some cool stuff. Good luck with your work too, Herb. Okay, so we leveled up artists. Ooh, we got a boombox. And artists are gonna want artists are gonna start wanting more stuff, which means I need to immediately tell artists not to come to my place. I'm so sorry. But I don't have these things yet. I can't afford them. But I do have a lot of fish. I thought I had more fish. Oh, no, I have fish for... Wait, what is the fish for? The fish is for the pet goods. I need nectar. All right, well, we'll go with a salad. And I can't afford lettuce, so. And uh, do I have, can I get a cutting board yet? Cutting board costs too much. So yeah, now we're getting into problems of we simply can't give people what they want. And it's okay, it's just, well, oh. Okay, we've unlocked cold brew coffee, a latte, and root beer. And now... Hmm. Let's go for more staff, because I'm enjoying having the staff. Did you not get your order yet? <laughs> Aside from attracting strays, I wish we could interact with the cats a little bit more, just like petting them on the on the fly. That'd be nice. But yeah, this is less stressful than I was thinking it was going to be. Um, and I realize it doesn't make sense to not advertise to everybody, so we'll just let everybody come in. If, if, if they can't get what they want, then that's, that's my bad. Um, okay, a boombox. Train up the staff. Let's train Ethan up to level six. Uh, cleaning, cooking, cleaning. Okay. 
I think the hard part is making sure that there's no pads that are blocked. Oh. Yep, get that water. I also appreciate that somebody was willing to work for me, knowing that I probably have zero business experience, but sure. Yeah, okay, so the delight is going up pretty fast. Um, let's see here, can I afford, can I at least afford lettuce for a salad? I can. Um, the cost of things is, is definitely hurting me here. So at the very least, I can make salads if somebody wants those. But people are happy for the most part. I just feel like they're going to be less happy when I can't give them exactly what they want in terms of more advanced foods. Um, let's also see about... Oops, no. I want to see about furniture. Because I can afford more chairs. So I can get five basic chairs. Um, okay, the thing is, if I put a chair... I need to expand the back wall, is the problem. Okay, so here's the thing. Ethan is not going to... If I don't have what they want, we're going to give them something approximate. It's not going to be exactly what they want. But I need to expand the um, the cafe so I have room for more things because this is where it gets hard for me is knowing where to put stuff. All right, uh, I can call somebody. Um, I guess we'll call business guy. I like the fact that they, they made Business Guy, like, he's not awful, but he's awful enough that you're just like, eh, alright, I guess. The coffee machine broke down, I got it. a litter box so that they stop peeing all over the store. And it doesn't appear that, so far, it, it, while you do go day by day, it doesn't appear like there's, you know, like I, like when we played um, the, uh, the Cozy Witch game, like there were definite things attached to days. This is just... Oops. Oh, my smart app tells me today's International Bountiful Breaks Day. Fake corporate holidays aside, looks to me like you've earned yourself a little break, bud. Honestly, I could probably use a few more breaks myself, but you know all about that hustle life, am I right? What sort of work do you do, Mateo? I'm the founder of Mateo and Mateo Management Means. We make, uh, conducive CMS systems. Now, rather than boring both of us by explaining what that even means, let me hit you with the jingle. Mateo, Mateo, manage and means fulfills your content management system dreams. What? No. 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 A CMS so hot, so cool, it smokes cigars and it skips... No. Heh. <laughs> TM. We're a small business, and that we is really just me at this point, but that is, we, that is I, do okay for ourselves. Myself? In fact, a while back we landed a new big client, Hawkable Acquisitions. I've been helping them set up here in Caterwall. We're going to drag this little town into the 21st century, baby. 
Hawkable can be a bit of a hawkish client, though. It's been a bit stressful? Seeking of stress, you caught me wondering. Does Herb have any hobbies? All right, I wasn't actually wondering that, but still, the question stands. I got lots of hobbies. Terrific, it's important to find needlessly elaborate ways to get your mind off work, isn't it? Oof, called out. Me? I've got too many of the dang things. Geocaching, extreme ironing, competitive duck herding. Actually, I just got this sweet do-it-yourself kombucha kit. I can't wait to sit there and wait for my stinky drink to grow molds or whatever. You've got time for all these hobbies? Ha, <laughs> busted. I sure do not. Honestly, I spend more time online buying stuff to start new hobbies than actually doing any of them. Uh-huh. Maybe finding new hobbies is my hobby? Hey, add that to my not sure if totally okay or existential crisis list. Just add it directly below. I still find farts funny. Thanks. Suddenly, Mateo's phone rings with the sound of an incessant buzzard. Oh, big bad client time. I gotta get this herb. Mateo's phone conversation quickly devolves into a landslide of inscrutable buzzwords. You leave him be. We received a dubious motivational poster. It simply says, Dare to Dream. Okay, it also leveled up business people, so they're going to want cold brew and Italian espresso soon. Um, yeah, I don't have root beer yet. Sorry. Let's put this poster on the wall. Wait, can I make cold brew yet? I probably need the recipe for cold brew. Let me go to town. Yeah, cold brew coffee recipe. That sounds like something I can make. Oh, I need milk for that. Okay, but maybe... Root beer requires bottled root beer. Okay, I can't afford that yet. So, I guess I'll get that next. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> but I've got some witches, so they should be able to give me some nectar to get some, to get some food. At what point in this is Mateo going to try to recruit us into Amway? I don't know, but Hawkable Acquisition sounds like they are, like... I also want to sing Hawkable Acquisitions like Doofenshmirtz Evil Incorporated, but it sounds like they're going to be the big bad that we've got to figure out how to how to take down. Um, okay, pay me a little bit more nectar so I can buy some bottled root beer. Yes! Okay, so now when they come and ask for root beer, I'll be able to do that. Uh, is there anything else I can buy? Because I have lots of fish. A little litter box. Or a floral litter box. Hmm. A little litter box serves three cats, so let's get one of those. Let's put the litter box... See, I feel like the litter box should go next to the bathroom. case we should move this oh don't did it again okay do I have enough if I put the chair here that blocks the way so I need oh wait do I have enough to build out one more wall or Okay, 20 built, 20 built, so... Mm -mm -mm. Mm. I could build out one more this way. Okay, and then if I move you here, you here... 
All right, fine. I'll move the table first. I'll put the rug over here to make it cozy. And then I can add a chair here and a chair here. That way we should be able to get around for the most part. It's not going to be great. Oh, we should move you as well. Why would you give me this massive statue? I do not know. And then staff. Did we level up again? Oh, time to level, level, level me up. Um, I'm going to go with service. And skip to morning. Okay, so now we can have more customers. And we should at least be able to serve root beer. Oh, you know what? We need to move the we need to move the cardboard box, don't we? Where's my No, that's not going to work. How about here? Or here. No, that's not here. I don't know. I think I'm going to have to put you in the inventory for now. All right. Uh, oh, Senpai, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. I still think it's funny that even to make a drink, we are... you get the root beer? We're still doing the pan cooking thing, even to give somebody a drink is kind of funny to me. Um, all right, we gotta start making, we gotta start taking some orders, pal. Okay, I appreciate that you can also take multiple orders without Apparently, I know how to make an Italian espresso, but it's taken me a while. Um, gotta refill the food. Um, okay, let's. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so glad. Um, all right, hold on. Oh, okay. Did, did you get your espresso? You did. Let's call up a regular, and that'll probably be about where we end it. So let's get one more conversation with a regular. Uh, it'll be Carla Lala. That should bring her up to our next level of friendship. And then I'll probably get going because I got to figure out dinner. Okay, so if I had better skill, it would be better. Okay, so for this, we just get this out of the fridge. Uh, you want a pretzel. That's easy enough. I need bread. All right, and you want tea, I think. So let's make some tea. Go give that customer some tea. Okay, if you can take that witch's order, I'll make the pretzel. Can you take her order, please? Thank you. There we go. Another Italian espresso. They've gotten hooked on the espresso now that we make it. Hello again, dear. Today's just lovely, isn't it? Your grand loved days like this as well. She'd stroll around town, a cat on each shoulder. Have you adjusted to living in Catterwall? I imagine there are far less garden witches than you're used to in the city. I'm still finding my bearing. Oh, just balcony witches in the city. True. Really? I cannot remember that. I can't imagine growing enough weeds on a balcony for even one dose of drool be gone. I do hope you feel welcome, dear. Say, if you happen to have any questions about witches or Catterwall, I'd be more than happy to answer them. Have there always been... Oh, can garden witches do that now? Have there always been witches in Catterwall? Actually, yes. Witches played an important role in the town's history. 
When the first settlers arrived here, they found the valley home to a tribe of wild cats. The cats hissed and scratched the settlers until they fled. One wise old witch made many sardine sacrifices to appease them. I don't remember the rest of the story, but I imagine they lived happily ever after. Can garden witches do magic? Carla Lala spits out her tea, presenting you with the molecular ideal of the mid-90s comic technique known as the spit take. I am so sorry. That's just such an adorable question. You really do not know much about witches, do you? Magic is a children's story, dear. Witches just make potions to cure a cold, rid you of boils, or make you float a little. We also talk to animals, but that is a closely guarded secret hidden for many generations. Any other questions? Do you know anything about the cat shrine? Oh, the cat shrine deep in the forest? I heard you were advocating for its renovation. How lovely. I know of it, but I have no idea what it is. The town's stray cats are quite taken with it, however. They're always lounging around there. I have a vague memory of the scary story the elder witches of my coven used to tell me to keep witchy kids out of the woods. If you ventured too close to the cat shrine, the shadow cat would make you its servant and you would stay in the forest until the end of your days. Someone should really tell the elder witches to stop being so spooky all the time. Alright, I'm out of questions. Thanks for the pleasant conversation. Now, I have some frogs to visit. Not to talk to them, because I can't. Goodbye, dear. Okay, and she gave me a feel fine feline filter. It says it's got a magic aura, but I don't. Does that mean if I. Hmm. Okay. Sorry, I was in the middle of making a drink. Go take that drink to that customer. Okay, we should be able to hire more staff, which might make things a little bit easier, because wowzers, things are getting busy. But the cats are so cute. Not quite. We almost made enough, so... And I said I would stop, but now I understand, because I do want to keep going. I really do. But we can always come back to this. But maybe you'll need to serve like one customer just to get just just to just to get that more staff setting. The worst. And my stomach is also starting to say, "Are you sure? One more turn, really? Because we we're we're hungry, is what we are." One of my favorite commercials. Oh, you're already doing it. One of my favorite commercials back in the day was the Civilization game commercial. And it actually had Sid Meier like, with a support group saying, Hi, I just want to say I'm Sid Meier and I'm sorry. <laughs> Although I have been seeing all the new reveals for Civ 7 and it's looking really good. Okay, so we can add one more staff person. Let's focus on cats again. Premium canned stray lore. Sure. And let's hire somebody, because dang, if we don't need the help. Zoe's looking for a job. My dad owned a bar, so I know my way around them. Okay, Zoe, you're hired. What is this trait? Oh, plus two to all skills when four pieces of magical... Okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Hey, Esoterica, welcome on in. Okay, we've now got some... we got some new staff. And things are... Things are moving. If you're doing that, I am going to expand... Once again. Ugh, almost. Almost! Well, I'm gonna expand anyway. Oh, no, that's right. That's right. I just need four. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, is everything okay? Oh, you got a cat. That's why you're okay. You need a cat. All right. Let me save the game. Yes. Over right. Did we do that right? Yeah. Over right. Okay. Um, hey, welcome back. Uh, we have. We are so far at day 15. Uh, we're doing pretty well. We have. Um, Let's see. Uh, our menu is is pretty good. We have got some new staff, uh, which we should train up. Uh, we'll get you good at that. Uh, we have some cats that deserve some leveling up. So, Harley, you got a new skill. I'll make it good for the artists. And Deborah, you got a new skill. You're good for the Vagabonds. And yeah, um, because I now have staff... Oops. Yeah, because I now have staff, I can just kind of sit here and worry about getting the ingredients, getting the other things. Um, it's all sort of running itself. Not running itself. I mean, I'm still, you know, doing the thing, but... But I need now to... Um, I need to shop for bread. So that's sort of like, it's 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 a really nice gameplay loop. Um, okay, we need bread. Let's see, your cold brew recipe needs milk. So if I do cold brew coffee, then I need to buy milk. Okay, so now I can do cold brew if somebody orders it. So yeah, it seems to be earning what you need to earn. And then of course with advertising, if too many people are asking for things that like you don't want or you want to specifically focus on one customer then versus the other, you can basically tell people to, you can kind of say like only this kind of customer show up, which is nice because like Vagabonds right now, they just want water. So you could just do water all day. Water, sorry, water all day. Um, but yeah, I am going to save for real. I really am. And uh, I'm going to head back. See, the things we can't go back to the main menu, but I am going to go ahead and quit because it's past time for me. Good night, Cat Cafe. You've done lovely. Uh, but thanks, everybody, for hanging out.